So I'm trying to get to Rome this morning, and it turns out I left my ID at work, so I had to take some of the metros to the train station. And I'm on this train that's really nice, and I'm thinking I might be on the wrong train, and I'm freaked out. So I, I walked past my hotel twice to get there, because I don't know what I'm doing. But I'm now in, in Rome, and I'm staying near the Spanish Steps. I have a tour here in about 30 minutes of some stuff I've seen before with my mother, but I wanted to see it again. So I'll make sure to take some pictures and video. It turns out that I hit all the trains on time and got here in record time. I'm actually really surprised. So um, anyway, I'm here and I'm safe and I'll be sure to include some video with some dialogue. So this is the first time I've seen it. And it's only 9.30 in the morning, so not too many tourists out yet. But as you can see, nothing but tourists taking pictures. Mm, the selfie sticks are a big hit here in Italy. Actually all over Europe. Don't get it. So I'm in the Pantheon, um, first dome ever made, um, back in 2nd century AD. I'll flip the camera around one more time. So this is probably the best preserved example of an ancient Roman building, and it's been enormously influential on um, all kinds of architecture. Very, very cool. Even today, you'll see government and public buildings like city halls and universities and public libraries kind of copy this portico and dome structure. This tour guide is a hundred times better than any of the ones I've had in the past, and it's a free walking tour. Absolutely awesome. So I'm at St. Peter's Square now, just finished my tour. Absolutely amazing. There's St. Peter's Basilica, surrounded by about 200 statues representing all the different seats. And that is the Pope's flat. So since I'm running on just cafe and a cornetto, it's time for me to find my lunch place where I made a reservation because I'm starving. So I made a reservation at this place and good thing because um, it's packed. Just kidding. And then I showed up 45 minutes late because I got on the wrong train. <laughs> and then when I got on the right one, it was delayed so I had to get a cab. So here I am, I just ordered the tuna and I ordered a salad and the guy gave me a huge glass of wine. I'll let you see that in a second. Great morning. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about it more later. I want to eat my lunch and then get going because I have another tour in two hours. Yeah. So this kid, Felipe, is going ape shit on the piano after he had the tuna steak I ordered was 10 to 12 ounces, and I don't think I finished it all. Kind of ridiculous. So it's Sunday morning and we're at St. Peter's Basilica for baby Roy's baptism. I work with Pat and Pat and Danny were kind enough to let me crash the baby's party with their family and friends. And this was the highlight of the weekend. 